What is going on, beautiful people? And welcome back to the channel. I have a confession to make, but first let me pull up a chair. Can you believe that it has been one whole year since I posted my last Cobble vlog episode? It's been crazy to think how much stuff has happened since then. A lot of change has happened since then. I've actually done, today is December 1st, and that marks 11 months sober for me. I haven't drank since last year. So I've been feeling really, really good. A lot of things have been happening all for the better. A lot of change, a lot of really, really good vibes. And um, I've been wanting to bring shoot this episode now for a while. I feel like I've been being called and like pulled into making longer form content for YouTube, not only to share with you guys, but to like document my life and my journey as we're in pursuit of becoming the best version of ourselves. And I just wanna show you guys and lead by example and prove to you that anything is really possible. When you set a goal and you are believing in what you're doing and you are destined to achieve it, you can really create anything, man. And this whole last year has really just been a testament to how possible it really is. So as you guys can see, in the background, we've changed up locations, we've um, switched up the model, been bringing some people down here to Cabo to enjoy it and um, to do some really cool, wholesome, good hearted stuff. So what we're going to do in this episode is I'm going to bring you guys up to speed on everything that's been going on for the most part. Try, I'll do my best and um, we're going to hit the gym. I'm going to show you guys this hidden um, guest spot that we have out back here, the recording studio. And uh, we're gonna, I'm just gonna bring you guys up to speed on what's been going on. All right, so this is my favorite spot of the whole house. As you can probably see why, we do our daily challenges out here. We hang out, that, the stairwell right here heads up to the balcony up there. That's just off the kitchen. And uh, we have this really chill outdoor living space with the barbecue out here. So we've had some good times out here. I have not been using the pool as much as I should be because when I got here in September, it was so hot. Could not escape the heat, but we're gonna be getting into the pool here now that the winter seasons are here and it's starting to cool off a little bit. Beauty, all right, let's go to the guest house. I wanna show you guys this little hidden spot that we have around back that I know you're gonna love. So let's go check it out. So welcome to the Veracast, we call it the Veracast Recording Studio. This casita was a really, really cool spot of the house that I really, really like, but I was never in here, you know? So when we transform this into the recording studio, it's given me the ability to come and spend time out here, which I really, really enjoy. But I wanna share with you guys a little bit about what we've been up to. So everything that I've been sharing with you guys on my YouTube channel about like taking chances, believing in yourself, investing in today for a better tomorrow has all of those things and like the step-by-step -step stuff has led up to this end result. And I want to just let you guys know, man, that dreams come true and you can do whatever it is you set your heart out to do, you know? And I just like being here in this house is just, it's a representation of what's possible. And I don't own this house. I haven't bought this house. I haven't made $10 million, but what this does show me is that it's possible that it's out there, you know, cause like a year or two or three, four ago, I was like dreaming of this moment right here, you know, and I just seeing that this has came to fruition just tells me that everything else is possible, man. And what we're doing here is absolutely incredible. So we have our personal development program. That's what Veritas is, is personal development, self mastery, and we've just been crushing it, man. So I'm excited because what the villa means is, is that we have the opportunity now to bring people down to San Jose del Cabo and to really put them through a week that will change their life. We can literally bring them down to paradise, pick them up, bring the chefs in, take them out to do activities, to face their fears and to just go after it, man. Because I know how important it is to have somebody in your corner that's gonna push you to do things that you may not have done on your own. You know what I mean? It's a really, it's a beautiful thing. It's beautiful. All right, so you guys let me know what you think of the podcast studio in here in the comments below. I'm curious to know and maybe we'll see you on one of our podcast episodes one of these days. But for right now, I'm gonna go outside. We get, um, we do 300 body weight reps every single day. So I'm gonna get that done before we head to the gym. And then I also just wanted to let you guys know 
that if you want to come out here and you want to stay with us and have this retreat experience where we're like skydiving, swimming with sharks, maybe swimming with orcas, who knows? If you want to come and have the experience of a lifetime, there are two different ways that you can make that happen. And um, it might be more achievable than you actually think possible. In the meantime, I'm gonna bring you guys along. We're gonna get our reps in. I'm gonna film it in time-lapse mode so it doesn't take a million. And then I gotta post it in the chat for accountability. So um, let's get it done. 300 body weight reps, and then we're gonna head off to the gym. So it is December 1st and we got our tree set up fam, whoop whoop. What do you think? I love it, love, love, love it. Take a view off the front deck here. So we are on a Greg Norman golf course here. It's super rad. When you're out in the recording studio, you can hear the, the guys hitting the tee box. We're right behind the ninth hole, super beauty. All right, second favorite time of day. We are off to the gym. Now, I usually don't love things. I love people, but fuck, I love this Bronco. Check it out. We have a murdered out Sasquatch wild track Bronco. This is the only black one I've seen here in the Baja and it is badass. I love this thing, man. All right, let's go on our way to the gym. So we just dropped the truck off. And usually I try and get two birds stoned. So I dropped it off, tried to get a car wash, but they're out of water. So we're gonna go in. I actually got a call from my boy here that owns the barber shop and said that he's got a spot for me. So we're gonna hit the barber shop, get our ears lowered, and then we're gonna hit the gym. But check out, so this is what's really cool. This is San Jose, Main Street. Much, much different vibe than you get in Cabo San Lucas. I really, really like it here. Maybe we'll do a street tour of San Jose for an episode, but um, it's beautiful here. Check this out. Look at that. So this is the art district here. So this town is like super artistic, super chill. Got all the little shops. I'm gonna go hit the bank here and grab some cash. Let's go. Here it is, dude. You see on the timer right there how every time I come in here we try and make the time a little bit faster and a little bit faster. Today he did my haircut in five minutes and thirty seconds. My Thanks boy right here. Reimagined. <laughs> Perfect. Perfecto. Muy rapido. Alright, that's a wrap. We got the haircut done. Fastest haircut in all of Mexico. Five minutes, thirty seconds. I really like that place. Alpha Barbershop, San Jose my boy Ernesto during uh, quarantine he used to pull up and he has this box truck and they converted it into like a mobile hair salon it's really rad and they go out into the barrio like some of the less fortunate neighborhoods and they cut hair for people for free so got a lot of respect for that obviously so I like to support my boy appreciate him and that's gonna wrap up this episode I decided we're gonna uh, do the gym reveal on the next episode so I just wanted to say man back i needed to get this episode out of the way and uh just come back out here and share these good vibes and uh document this journey of life that we've been so fucking blessed with so love and appreciate you guys man we'll see you on the next episode